Oral and maxillofacial surgery is a branch of surgery. As the name suggests, the focus of oral and maxillofacial surgery is the mouth, the jaw region, the face, and the base of the skull. However, as with many surgical fields, the surgical area is not limited to those regions alone, but can be broadened by various flap operations, rib transplantations, iliac crest transplantations for bone replacement, and transplantations of the small intestine as a substitute for the oral mucosa. Contrary to, say, plastic surgeons, the oral and maxillofacial surgeon is also trained in hard tissue surgery, such as bone surgery. What are the benefits for the facial area? We would like to explain this through an example. Here you see the profile view of a face. You may be able to recognize the receding chin. A plastic surgeon would likely inject the chin with the patient's own fat. This plastic correction would last for several years, but would then have to be repeated. The orthodontist, on the other hand, separates the bony part of the chin through a tiny cut in the oral cavity, and then attaches it in an advantageous position. The bone heals, and the result is permanent. If there is also a skeletal malocclusion, then the orthodontist brings the entire jaw area, and not just the chin, into a better position. Additional optimal facial corrections may be achieved through a combination of soft tissue procedures, for example a facelift, and traditional hard tissue surgeries. Dentists work in close cooperation with orthodontists, particularly in cases concerning tumor diagnosis and aftercare.